What's up, Raging Nation? How's it going? This is Alex Yu, and it is trailer reaction time. And you can see a big smile on my face, and I really don't know why, because I really don't know anything about Guardians of the Galaxy. It is exactly 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time right now, and Guardians of the Galaxy, the very first trailer is online and I'm gonna do reaction and review for you guys and like I said before I know nothing about it except for it has Groot, Star-Lord, Gamora, uh, the big guy played by Dave Bautista and Rocket Raccoon voiced by Bradley Cooper. That's all I know about it and it's part of the Avengers Phase 2 universe and I think the main reason why I'm excited about it because I know nothing about it but I'm looking forward to it. Let's do the Let's let's watch the the, the trailer right now, okay? machine work. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! That's mine. Hey! Take those headphones off right now! That looked pretty cool, and like I said, I didn't know what to expect, and I didn't know it was gonna have that much humor in it, and um, I didn't know that John C. Uh, the the John C. Riley is that his name, the guy from Step Brothers? I didn't know he was gonna be in it. Uh, the Jaimon Han Su is in it. Uh, um, who else is in it? Uh, uh, I didn't recognize anybody else other than that. Uh, Zoe Saldana plays Gamora, Dave Bautista plays Drax the Destroyer, and it looks like a lot of the comic relief is going to come from Chris Pratt, but I think that Rocket Ra Rocket Raccoon is going to be the, uh, he's going to steal the show. I just have a feeling that Rocket Raccoon is going to steal the show because there's this one scene where you see him going Brrrr, and it's a raccoon, and I'm just thinking, is that the raccoon from Earth, or, or like, does he, does he, um, have a, a a thing like like why can he talk and uh, what's also interesting is that Vin Diesel voices Groot but we didn't hear him say anything in the trailer maybe in a few trailer like in, in a couple other trailers we'll see him start talking but that is the very first trailer and one thing that is very interesting is that uh, you see the collector you know who the collector is if you watch Thor the Dark World at the end credit scene okay at the uh, yeah the post credit scene there is a scene where a Sif and the uh, the other the other the other buddy of Thor they go and hand over the um, 
uh, the Tesseract or, or something to, to the collector played by Benicio Del Toro. Well, you see him in this trailer. So you can see how Thor The Dark World is connected with Guardians of the Galaxy. Now, I'm really curious to know how Guardians of the Galaxy, the most disconnected film from the Avengers franchise, is actually connected with the Avengers. And there you have it. That's all I gotta say in this video, and I'm pretty excited. That looked pretty cool, and it's about time that we saw some just far out there sci-fi. Okay, I, I just want to see some some really cool sci-fi action. And one thing I gotta mention is that I like Chris Pratt. I have, I've I liked them since the, the first time I saw him in Zero Dark Thirty. He was playing a supporting role in uh, as a Navy SEAL, and right after I saw him do that, even though it was a very minor role, I was thinking that hey. You know what? I like that guy. I want to see him in more movies. And there we go. Here in his starring role as the main lead as Star-Lord. And he calls himself that. <laughs> Anyways, that's all I got to say in this video. Check out the Guardians of the Galaxy trailer. It's in the description box below. And there you have it. As always, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Like me on Facebook, Raging Nation. Also follow me on Twitter at Raging Nation. I'll see you next time. Peace. It looks like they, they slapped on a rubber suit and they added sound effects to make it sound like it's heavy. But it doesn't work for me, and that distracts me from the character. It distracts me from.